The Ministry of Health is cautioning Kenyans to observe good personal hygiene practices during the festive season in the wake of emerging health threats such as cholera. Health Cabinet Secretary Suza Nakamuche says though the government has issued an alert to the health workers across the country, Kenyans should be vigilant to prevent chances of infection and spread of epidemic-prone diseases. As Zainab said, side reports, the Cabinet Secretary has also appealed to doctors to call off their strike planned to start in January 2023. Health Cabinet Secretary Susan Nahumicha notes that although the government has put in place a raft of measures to mitigate against the spread of epidemic-prone diseases, the bug stops with the public. People are encouraged to ensure frequent hand washing and sanitization at all times and wearing of face masks in confined spaces. Those with flu-like symptoms should always wear face masks when in close proximity with other members of the public. At the same time, the cabinet secretary called on the Kenya Medical Practitioners and Dentist Union to call off its planned industrial action, promising to initiate dialogue with all healthcare workers' unions. I urge all professional associations, labor unions in the sector to embrace positive dialogue as we serve the beloved citizens who we took an oath to diligently serve. Nahumecha at the same time called on the county government to pay Kenya Medical Supplies Agency all pending bills to enable it deliver on its mandate. The, if these monies are not paid, then they cause us interruptions in the supply chain. You know, it's a continuous supply chain that when we receive funds from the counties, we are able to pay our suppliers and therefore able to stock products that we eventually release to them. According to the Cabinet Secretary, plans by the national and county governments to remunerate close to 9,000 community health care workers countrywide are at an advanced stage. For Prime Edition, I'm Zainab Said.